prove that n cube minus n is divisible by 6. Now n cube minus n can be written as n into n square minus 1. I am taking n common out from this n cube. So n into n square minus 1. This n square minus 1 square 1 is can be written as a square minus b square. So n square minus 1 square is equal to n plus 1 into n minus 1. Now I am rearranging this n minus 1 this n here and n plus 1 into the here. So this is product of three terms. You can take any three numbers like 14, 15, 16 or 20, 21, 22 can be written in this form. So any three numbers, consecutive numbers are surely divisible by 6. You can check 20 into 21 into 22, multiply and divide it by 6. It will exactly divisible. So here we know, we know any positive integer can be written in the form 6 cube, 6 cube plus 1, 6 cube plus 2, 6 cube plus 3, 6 cube plus 4 or 6 cube plus 5. Now case 1, n is equal to 6 cube. Substitute n is equal to 6 cube here. We already found n cube minus n can be written as n minus 1, n and n plus 1. I am substituting n is equal to 6 cube. So 6 cube minus 1, 6 cube and 6 cube plus 1. Here 6 cube, 6 is a common factor here. Therefore, it is divisible by 6. Now case 2, n is equal to 6 cube plus 1. Now substitute n is equal to 6 cube plus 1 here. So 6 cube plus 1 minus 1. For this n, 6 cube plus 1. And again for this n, 6 cube plus 1 plus 1. So here 1, 1 got cancelled. So 6 cube. Here 6 cube plus 1. Here 6 cube plus 2. Therefore, it is divisible by 6. Case 3, n is equal to 6 cube plus 2. Again, n cube minus n is equal to n minus 1 into n into n plus 1. Subst I am substituting n is equal to 6 cube plus 2. So, 6 cube plus 2 minus 1. Here, 6 cube plus 2. Here, 6 cube plus 2 plus 1. So, here, subtracting 2 minus 1, 6 cube plus 1. Here, 6 cube plus 2. Here, 2 plus 1 becomes 6 cube plus 3. 6 cube plus 1. In this 6 cube plus 2, I am taking 2 common. So this becomes 3 cube plus 1. Here from this 6 cube plus 3, I am taking 3 common out. So this becomes 2 cube plus 1. Now multiply this 2 into 3. So 2 into 3 becomes 6 into the 6 cube plus 1, this 3 cube plus 1 and this 2 cube plus 1. So here 6 is a common factor. Therefore it is divisible by 6. Now case 4, n is equal to 6 cube plus 3. Again substitute in the place of n. 6 cube plus 3 minus 1. 6 cube plus 3 and 6 cube plus 3 plus 1. So 3 minus 1. This becomes 6 cube plus 2. Here 6 cube plus 3. Here 3 plus 1 becomes 6 cube plus 4. So I am taking 2 common from here. So this becomes 2 into 3 cube plus 1. Here I am taking 3 common out. So this becomes 3 into 2 cube plus 1. And here 6 cube plus 4. Again. 2 into this 3 becomes 6 into 3 cube plus 1, 2 cube plus 1 and 6 cube plus 4. Therefore, here 6 is a common factor. Therefore, it is divisible by 6. It's case 5. n is equal to 6 cube plus 4. Again, substituting here. 6 cube plus 4 minus 1, 6 cube plus 4, 6 cube plus 4 plus this one. So, this becomes 4 minus 1. 6 cube plus 3, 6 cube plus 4, here 4 plus 1 becomes 6 cube plus 5. I am taking 3 common here. So 3 into this becomes 2 cube plus 1. We are taking 2 common, 2 into 3 cube plus 2, here 6 cube plus 5. Now 2 into 3 becomes 6 into 2 cube plus 1, 3 cube plus 2 and 6 cube plus 5. Here 6 is a common factor. Therefore, it is divisible by 6. Now, case 6, n is equal to 6 cube plus 5. So, substitute again, n 6 cube plus 5 minus 1. Here, 6 cube plus 5. 
here 6 cube plus 5 plus 1 so 5 minus 1 6 cube plus 4 6 cube plus 5 here 6 cube plus 6 so 6 cube plus 4 6 cube plus 5 here I am taking 6 common out so 6 into cube plus 1 so 6 into 6 cube plus 4 6 cube plus 5 and cube plus 1 here 6 is a common factor therefore it is divisible by 6 so all cases are divisible by 6 therefore n cube minus n is exactly divisible by 6 i hope you understand this problem thank you